Hello, parents and students of the Murak Joint Unified School District. Kevin Cordes, District Superintendent. Thanks for joining us with our Mondays with Murak episode for this week. So as we're wrapping up the school year, just want to big, give a big congratulations out to our graduating classes and our promoting classes that are coming up. We look forward to celebrating with you and honoring your successes. So just be on the lookout for information coming out from both schools related to details on, on those ceremonies. Um, I'd like to speak for just a moment to the community in Boron, specifically to the pool, and give uh, another update. So where we're at right now is we do, we have a contractor who is working on the decking. So all the concrete that surrounds the pool. Um, that person has been secured and work has begun to tear out the decking so that we can replace it with new concrete. We've ordered um, the mechanical equipment, so pumps and heaters and all of that type of stuff for the pump house. That all is on um, back order at the moment. We're waiting on things to come in. And the next thing that we need is we still need someone who can do the plastering work itself. So just to clear up any confusion, we have found contractors, but they subcontract out different parts of the job. And the part that we really are struggling to find is a subcontractor who actually does the pool work, the replacing of the gunite and um, all of the materials that are inside the coping that goes along the top of the deck for the pool. So we're still working on that piece, and either way, we'll figure out a way to make this work. Um, but just to let you know, work is, is, has started, and it is moving along. And so a big thank you again to everyone um, who's contributed. We will have opportunities for people to come in and possibly do some volunteer work. Um, we're doing some work inside the pool house itself, too, where, we, where you change um, into your swimming suit. You know, we use those areas for football, for the visiting team, they use that area, um, and for other events as well. So that is a scope, a part of the scope of the project that we're working on. And uh, if you come out to Boron High School on Saturday, you may even see people working. Um, I know that there's going to be an event there on Saturday. So uh, anyone that comes out, you might see some of us working out there on that day. So any other questions about pool, please feel free to reach out to the school uh, district, reach out to us. It works better than social media or a neighbor or someone you know, at the store. Just give us a call, ask us, shoot us an email, whatever it is. We'd be happy to share with you the updates related to that. Um, with that, as we get into the end of the school year, any questions or concerns that you have about next year, please feel free to bring those up now. So for high school students, if you have questions regarding your class schedule for next year, now's a good time to have those discussions um, with, with our academic advisors. Um, anyone that knows of any special circumstances you might have for your child for next year, go ahead and let us know now. We would like to know that. And just as an announcement for you, summer school, we will be offering summer school this year. It will be a six-week program. We'll offer it for students in elementary and in high school. For elementary, it's going to be a lot of enrichment and filling in any of those educational gaps that might have popped up whenever we were doing distance learning with COVID. Uh, for high school students, it'll be credit recovery. We will give priority to seniors and to eighth grade students and then those grade levels that bump up to those so that we can help students who are ready to progress to the next stage of life as easily as possible. So high school will be coming, everyone will come in person. A high school will come in person and work through edgenuity to make up their credits. You can make up as many as you can in that six week period. And for elementary, you'll come in and we're gonna run, uh, we'll run that at the elementary schools on base uh, for elementary schools. For high schools, I'll get you more information on where that'll be located exactly um, in upcoming weeks. For elementary, it will be here on base at the elementary schools. We'll bus students from Boron and we'll run in the mornings from approximately eight to noon, get a sack lunch before you go home. And we're also gonna be building in a ton of enrichment activities. Some work in maker spaces, opportunities to fly um, in some flight simulators, 
and um, a, a ton of other things that we're currently working on right now. So we'll make further announcements about that, but the summer enrichment program this year for elementary students um, is coming back online. It's something we haven't done for quite a few years, but we're excited to bring that back and just wanted to announce that. With that, we hope everyone has a great weekend um, and a wonderful week next week. We'll catch up on our next video next week, and we'll see you then. Bye-bye.